Allison Hayslip here and Ride is at CES 2020. We're currently in the Honda booth and with me is Marcus Fromer, uh, one of Honda's spokespersons. And you're gonna walk me through what Honda is doing yeah. here at CES. Yeah, so we're right now, we're sitting in the augmented driving concept. And it's extremely comfortable. I'm glad you like it. It's beautiful inside. I might just take a nap here while we're here. Please do. Uh, you might get kicked off by the other people waiting to get That's in. But, so the augmented driving concept addresses the transition of the driving experience from manual to autonomous. Okay. So in the autonomous future, uh, our drivers will no longer have a responsibility for driving. Correct. But at the same time, these customers may still want that experience. They still want to experience what it is to get behind the wheel. We still want control. <laughs> yes, people like that, right? Yes. And they, they will have that opportunity with the augmented driving concept. It will shift seamlessly from autonomous to semi-autonomous mode using our reinvented steering wheel. Okay. So just by tapping the top of the steering wheel, you can start it, and there it is. Oh, oh yeah, it's like, hello, I'm awake. All right. And then by pushing it also lights up. A little bit. You can accelerate. There you go. You can see oh. that you're accelerating. You like to drive fast. I can see. Obviously, I'm going 45 right now. You can just pull it, pull it back. Towards you and it'll slow it's down. so weird. Did you see my foot naturally I, want I to go to a brake pedal? There's no the pedal. Pedals, but there is no brake pedal. I know there's no pedals at all. Because ultimately, this is an autonomous vehicle. This vehicle will take control if it needs to take control or if you will get tired of driving right. and you want to do something else while you're enjoying your autonomous or semi-autonomous. Oh, and while you turn experience. the numbers, uh, stay vertical. That's great. So what happens if I'm driving and all of a sudden I want to be fully autonomous? Do I just? Just let go. Let go. Take a nap. Enjoy. It's going to keep on driving. It'll keep you safe. The autonomous system is operating at all times. Do you guys have a goal for when something like this would actually come to fruition? You know, we don't have a goal, but this is more an opportunity to start a discussion around what will it mean for us to be driving around in autonomous vehicles? What will you do with your time? Will you want to work? Will you want to play? Will you want to drive? It'll be up to you. And that's really what we're talking about right now. What do you personally feel like is our biggest roadblock to full autonomy right now? Well, I think there are a few. Uh, number one, the technology still needs to be mature. Um, secondly, we need the right policies in place, the right regulations in place um, to allow for autonomous vehicles. And third, we need the proper infrastructure. Uh, the, the way the roads are built right now, they're going to be a little bit different in the future. Right? They're blind. So there's a few things that have to happen. Most importantly, though, consumer acceptance. Consumers have to feel comfortable, they have to feel safe, and they have to feel that they can afford the vehicle. This is going to be a real deep cut, but did you ever watch the animated cartoon of The Tick from the 90s, the, like the late 90s? I know it, but I can't say I... Oh my gosh, one of the villains that The Tick had to fight was simply the world's most comfortable chair. Oh. And the problem is, is that as soon as you sat in yeah. it, you literally fell asleep because you were so comfortable. So you couldn't great. fight it. You couldn't fight it. I, I and that's like what that. I feel like I'm in right now. I can't okay. fight it. Well, don't fight it. Thank Just goodness the car go. can drive itself because <laughs> I'm out. I'm out. Uh, don't Mark, wake her up. Marcus, thank you so much. Is there anything else Honda's like focusing on here at CES? Well, we have a wide range of uh, exhibit items ranging from a home energy management concept to uh, ergonomic devices for manufacturing environment. So hope you'll hope you'll take a look around and check them out. We have to see okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a great CES. Don't fall asleep. No, I, I make no problem. <laughs>